This video will help you to make calculations in standard form. You will find the key steps on the screen and I will demonstrate this live. Numbers in standard form are entered on the calculator using the times 10 to the power of key here on the bottom row. Let's enter the number 2.5 times 10 to the power of 10. First, enter the 2.5 and then press the times 10 to the power of key. Now enter the power of 10. Notice that the calculator automatically puts the power in the correct position. Press the Execute key and the calculator displays the number in standard form. Now let's add 8.2 times 10 to the power of 9. Simply press the Addition key and the calculator recalls the previous number as ANS. Enter the 8.2 and then press the times 10 to the power of key followed by 9. Now press the Execute key to complete the calculation and the answer is given in standard form. Now let's try multiplying these two numbers. Enter the 2.5 times 10 to the power of 10 and then press the right scroll key to exit from the number. Press the multiplication key and enter 8.2 times 10 to the power of 9. As the entry is finished, you don't need to scroll out of the number this time to complete the calculation. Simply press the Execute key. The answer is given in standard form. Now let's try division. We'll divide 8.2 times 10 to the power of 9 by 2.5 times 10 to the power of 10. There are two methods to do this. Division in standard form differs from previous versions of the calculator as it now follows bid mass strictly. We recommend using a fraction for division to avoid errors. Press the fraction key and enter 8.2 times 10 to the power of 9 in the numerator. Scroll down and enter 2.5 times 10 to the power of 10 in the denominator. Now press the Execute key to complete the calculation. The calculator has displayed the answer as a fraction, so press Format and choose Decimal to change it to a decimal. The answer is given as a normal decimal, not in standard form. Positive numbers less than 10 to the power of 9 display as normal numbers by default. However, you can display any number in standard form by using Settings. Press Settings and choose Calc Settings. Scroll down and choose Number Format. Now scroll down to Psi. The calculator calls Standard Form Scientific Form. Choose this with OK and scroll down to choose the number of significant figures you want, perhaps three. Confirm this with OK. Now press the Back key enough times to return to the app. Press the Execute key and format as a decimal and the answer is given in standard form. This setting will apply to all calculations until you change it, for example by resetting the calculator. You can use the division key, but remember to use brackets around each standard form number. If it helps, you can use brackets for all standard form operations. That way you won't forget with division. I do think it's worth spending some time mastering how to use standard form with the times 10 to the power of key and with fractions for division.